Wow, Friday afternoon. I got a big picnic tomorrow. And uh, we look like we might have up towards 60 people showing up. So uh, once I get through this incredible Friday afternoon traffic on Memorial Weekend, we'll kick Fry the Chef in with the big picnic for spring. Memorial Costco. Weekend. Got everything we need. My car has the entire picnic uncooked in it right now. As you can see, all the food, all the fluids. Now we just gotta make them into something. Here we go. Oh man. Oh. What time is it? Oh. Oh boy. In the process of stop cooking with some cold water. This one's already done. Red at the tori. These are farfarla bowl. So we barbecue the top part, put it back in the oven, let it firm up, and then we'll just put some sauce on the pan to get the bottom part. So it'll be nice and crusty on top and juicy on the bottom and delicious. So there's our mac salad. We have uh, California olives, red onions, uh, shredded carrot, and uh, mayonnaise, salt and pepper. Easy, simple, and done. Maria! Don't put me in! Split romaine in half. Put the halves in a tray. And you add a little olive oil to it. Now we throw it on the What are you two looking at? What are you looking at? Huh? What are you looking at, Rox? You don't put these on for long. You just pretty much want to sear them. What do I watch when I'm cooking? Cooking shows. Steve Brakeland. Barbecue. Ooh. So here's the game plan for this big hunk of sirloin. This is a sirloin cap, which is one of the best cuts ever in the world. The French absolutely love them, call them hanger steaks. It's got a big piece of fat on the top and we'll put that around and let it melt down. Add Montreal steak seasoning. I'm gonna cut it in half so I get two roasts and that way it'll finish. Uh, combining two types of baked beans, put them in the roasting pan and then put them in the oven for about 40 minutes so they're hot when we take them to the beach. You have the grilled romaine cut into eighths and then stacked up nicely. We add uh, California olives, so we have the same kind of flavor going in from the macaroni salad into the regular salad. Uh, we have chopped fresh big mushrooms and we're gonna add uh, a little carrot to the top for decoration and then the Italian dressing when we get there. Don't put the dressing on until you get there or it will melt. Now we have the carrot on for decoration and we just put some plastic wrap over the top. Pretty much most of the side dishes on the way. So if I'm forgetting something, what is it? Oh yeah, I haven't taken a shower. All right, 10.31. We need to get there by 11. So we're going to uh, finish loading the car. It's already done. And I'll show you how to do that. It's a matter of keeping everything um, warm or cold and away from each other. So here's my mighty explorer, serve me well. I have a cooler where the hamburgers and the hot dogs, we have our charcoal, we have our condiments, we have our sodas down below. In the back, we have the hots. So here's the beef right there. Underneath it is the baked beans. Hopefully it won't spill, but I have plastic. And then below that is the chicken. Here we have our pasta salads. Here we have our garden salads with the uh, roasted um, romaine our buns, all the equipment needed to cook, our desserts, our cups. Looks like we got us a picnic happening right now. All right, so I reached in my bag and my knife was unsheathed. And that's how I'm starting things. So let's get our equipment on. And we're ready. <laughs> oh, please, no laughing. <laughs> Would you like me to take it? Grills are going. Folks have shown up. I think that's why I was getting so excited. Who's gotten in line early? <laughs> no. You haven't. These are the problems we go through. So we're going to carve this up. We have all the meat here. We have the veggies down there. The ocean's a little angry, but fun. Looks like we got a great turnout. So here's the aftermath. We gave him a second choice. We 
fed the herd first round. Now we'll get some second round. I like it. You're welcome. <laughs>